Hi everyone, my name is Sarah Grisson. I'm your instructor for Human Sexuality Psych 107. I want to introduce you to our class. I want to let you know a little bit about the class, a little bit about our goals, and a little bit about how we're going to be interacting in the class and what you can expect. First of all, I'm a psychologist. I have a PhD in psychology and I've spent the last 25 years or so teaching psychology in high school and at the university level. My background is in cognitive neuroscience, which is how we think and how the brain lets us think, especially with respect to paying attention and remembering things. So I know a lot of ways to help students learn information, and you're going to see that throughout the class. I also have an interest in human development, partially because I teach the classes a lot in child development and adolescent development, and also because I have two children of my own who are entering puberty. So human sexuality is a big issue in our house because I have to figure out what to teach them and how to teach it. Maybe that's true of you as well. In terms of our class, what you're going to experience is a little bit of a mixture of psychology, sociology, and biology as we go through the class. The psychology is an approach to human sexuality that focuses on understanding how we think, how we feel, and how we act in terms of our sexuality. The sociology aspect looks at our culture and how that influences how we act the way we do. It also looks at things like our socialization. How do we come to know what we know about sex? Who is it that's taught us what we know? What are the expectations according to our culture? Also, what do we see in the media and advertisements and in movies and how does that impact us? We're going to take a look at that from the social aspect of sexuality. Lastly, we're going to have to find out about the biology. Now, I know of you, a lot of you may think that you know all there is to know about the biology of sex, but I'm here to tell you there are things you're going to learn that are probably going to surprise you this semester. So, I want you to get used to the idea that we're going to be talking about penises, vaginas, anuses, all sorts of body parts. So get comfortable using those terms because we're going to use them frequently, okay? We're going to learn a lot about how these body parts and our brains and our hormones make us want to have sex or not, make sex pleasurable or not, or maybe give us issues that cause problems or dysfunctions with sex. So we're going to talk about this this semester as well. Lastly, I want to let you know that because we're covering a lot of sensitive subjects, please be careful. Not everyone has the same experiences or opinions as you. So when we're discussing things in our discussion forum, Please make sure that if you want to state your beliefs, feel free to do so. But we're all going to share our beliefs in a way that's respectful of everybody's beliefs. Beliefs aren't right or wrong. They're just personal beliefs. On the other hand, we're also going to talk about scientific evidence. What are the facts that we know about human sexuality? And that we're going to talk about as well. So as long as we keep a kind and supportive tone in our discussions, we're going to have a lot of fun talking about a lot of really juicy topics. And you're going to learn a lot of things as well. So that's it for me now. I look forward to seeing you in the class very soon. Thanks so much.